Okay, hello fellow traders. So today is actually 3rd of August and um, just had a fantastic trading week. So one of the subscribers wrote in uh, saying that um, he actually lost money and uh, we felt that uh, this shouldn't happen, right? especially when we had a good week. So today, I'd just like to uh, film a short video just for you to understand about two things. Number one, uh, I'd like to talk about risk management. And number two, we want to give you a, a Meta Trader 4 indicator. Uh, to calculate your position size. So our previous video did cover about uh, the right position size, but that was uh, on the website, right? Uh, that was on, if I'm not wrong, was on babypips.com. So that way of calculating position size is a bit slow. So today, um, we have we would like to share with you our own indicator that we use to help you calculate your position size quickly. Okay, just on your chart, um, you see over here. Okay, uh, tells me to trade a position size of 2.38 standard lots. Okay, so anyway, let me just go on to the first point, which is about risk management. Okay, so uh, always remember that there's no such thing as a 100% uh, hit rate in trading. Okay, there will always be losses. So what makes you a profitable trader is the ability to manage your risk. Okay, and especially when something is not working, you know, when you're having a losing streak, to actually stick through it and not just, uh, you know, hop from system to system or for in your case, it will be from uh, signal provider to signal provider. So uh, we, we normally recommend um, the risk between 1% to 3% per trade. Okay, so what does that mean? So let, let's just do some maths. Let's say your account size is, uh, account size is uh, 1,000, okay? And you wish to risk uh, 1%, okay? So one risk one percent, okay. That's uh, actually hundred dollars, which is okay because you can afford to lose, you know, eight times, ten times in a row. It it doesn't really damages your account that much, okay. So the question is, let's say you want to raise hundred dollars, right? So what is the position size that uh you need, uh to buy? Okay, uh, one of the things that we over here at Financial Market Wizards we don't believe in is a fixed lot sizing. Fixed lot sizing means that you always, uh, for example, you always enter with a 0 0.1, uh, 1 mini, 1 micro, you know. The reason for that is because uh, if you always use uh, standard 1 size, for example, 0 0.1, and this trade has a large stop loss, it's going to, it's going to damage your account, okay. So naturally, uh, if the stop loss is wider, Okay, if the stop loss is wider, then naturally you have a uh, smaller, smaller uh, position size. And if your stop loss is smaller, you have a bigger position size. So let me demonstrate. So for example, in case one, you have a stop loss of, uh, you know, uh, 50 pips. Okay. 50 pips, okay. And in uh, two, you have a stop loss of 100 pips. Okay, so question is, what position size do you need? Okay, so the indicator that we have over here, which we'll send to you, right? Just uh, click the link below. You can download it, uh, install your Meta Trader, and uh, you can use it. So in this case, um, you see there's only two parameters: stop loss and risk percentage. So stop loss means uh, is, this is in pips. So in our case, for fifty pips, and you risk to risk one percent. Just click OK. And you see the number over here. This is 2.38. So in this case, uh, just a moment. Okay. Yes, in this case, your position size uh, 2.38. Okay. And in this case, I mean, it's actually just a half of it. But uh, let me just demonstrate to you, okay? So you just put 100 pips, okay? Let's see, 1.19. So you see with this tool, it's very simple to know, um, to know what is the exact position size that you should be trading, taking per trade, okay? So now you might ask, um, should I always risk 1%, 2% or 3%, you know? Uh, I think it doesn't really matter whether you choose 1, 2 or 3%, but most importantly is to stick to it. If you're going to risk 3% per trade, each trade, make sure you're consistent. So just, you know, just adjust this to 3% and never adjust this ever again. Then adjust this, okay? I also like to say that this, uh, this percent is off 
your um if i'm not wrong it's off your account balance okay not equity so of course um it's better to to take the percent of your account balance because equity fluctuates you know you may have a big winner and you know the uh, unrealized profit is very high it makes you trade a bigger stop loss but end up your that position doesn't attain your profit because you get stopped by break even or you know it becomes a loss so you don't want overexposure so we hope this video is video has been beneficial to you. Once again, click the link below to download this indicator, install it, and uh, we hope that uh, this will help you to become a consistent trader, right? And definitely hit the subscribe button and we'll see you in the next video.